Hello, everybody. Hello. Jason just put popcorn in his mouth. That's why I said hello. Anyway, uh, we're... Who's a Mike and Ike? Oh, I'm sorry. I Mega thought Mix. I thought Ten flavors. Eating popcorn. Gluten-free and fat-free. Dude, Mike and Ike's are legit candy. Like, they're... Not just because my name's in there, but mm. um, they're legit candy. Anyway, we're landing on another planet that probably isn't going to lead to anything exciting, so we're just going to chat some more about... Yeah. Uh, E-Feds. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, that was my, like, nerdy internet pastime. Mm. Did you ever have an online girlfriend? No. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> Mike made, Mike just smiled when I looked at him. Mike, you got an internet girlfriend? Okay. Well, hold on. Don't. Okay, I had, I had, like, the meme, like, I was old enough to, like, be like fucking around. Uh huh. And it was like, I would say I was like maybe 13 or 14. Right. But it's just like the whole like meme of like going into something and being like looking for a big titty goth girlfriend like type. Oh, like okay. Meme, you know? Right. So I, I, I did that, but just, like, joking around with my friends. But like, mine, mine's a little weirder than that. <laughs> mine, mine was not, like, legit, like, hey, how's it going? Like, I love you. Well, mine wasn't <laughs> exactly that. I got to explain. Um, so defend were, yourself. <laughs> were AOL chat rooms still a big deal when you nope. started? Okay. So this was – are you fucking kidding me? Another one of these fucks? Like, get a different enemy type, fucking Bioware. How did he spit that way? <laughs> He's a legend. What the hell? He's a legend. Anyway, um, so AOL chat rooms and were, like, everything, right? Right, like, yeah, yeah. And, like, they also had AIM, like, you know, but yeah, you yeah. wouldn't know people on AIM until you, like, met them in, like, an internet chat room, right? Or yeah. they were, like... Friends at school, I guess. Yeah, or, or like friends of friends or something. But, so, I one day wandered into like a a, a role play chat room, not like a sexual role play. It was just like, oh, this is this chat room is called like uh, Planet Namic, right? Okay. So this was when I was in middle school, probably. Okay. And. So it'd be like everybody was like role playing like Dragon Ball Z characters, right? Okay. Like their own made up Dragon Ball Z characters too. Like okay. and of course everybody was a fucking Saiyan and Yeah. You know, or half Saiyan or whatever. Or like And they all had a sword like trunks and <laughs> you know, of course my guy did too. Yeah, okay, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um so I remember you know, you'd make friends doing that kind of thing. Wow, that guy was easier than the other one, that's for sure. But you'd make friends doing that kind of thing. And I remember I started dating this girl in in, in, in like our characters rooms. were dating, but it was also like mm. we talked on aim, you know? Like outside of the outside role play. of that? Yeah. I mean as far as you know it was As far a role as play. I know it was a girl. I have no clue to this day if it was a girl. <laughs> I don't remember her screen name. <laughs> oh, no. It was like Angel something. That's so sad. Yeah, it was sad. But I remember um, <laughs> I remember being very real to me because okay. I remember being in church. Okay. <laughs> and I, you know, I'm not, we're not going to get into a discussion about church here, but I, I, I did not grow up going to church, like, real young. And then we started going to church in, in my young teenage years. Yeah. And so I wasn't really into it. Um, you're well, like, I just want to sleep in. Right, <laughs> right. And the only reason I went is because my dad would bring candy and said, hey, I'll let you eat candy in church if you... Yeah. Me being a, me Don't being fall asleep. A, me being a thick boy, I was like, all right, I'm all about this candy. <laughs> um, Starburst jelly beans, my guy. Oh, my um, God, yes. Or, ate, or cherry bombs. I've ate an immense amount of both of those. Anyway, so I remember I was in church, and it was during like the worship part of it, so everybody's singing. And I just could not wait to get home to talk to my girlfriend on AIM. Oh. My, my fake girlfriend. This place that, looks abandoned. Damn. That isn't really a person. I mean. Or she was. And then I remember 
she just like vanished. She Damn. just stopped getting online. According to these data, I, I was like, the survey team unearthed some kind of alien technology. Why is why are these voices? will find more answers at the excavation site. But huh. I remember just being like devastated and just man, being dude. like, oh man. Just like, oh, she probably just couldn't get on, get I, on every fucking day, just like right. looking at that name, like she'll get on. And then I remember being like, Which, fuck. I remember being like, that I think my she, heart. I think she actually got on like. I remember seeing it like years later, like going to get onto my aim, and then she was like online, and I just, just was like. What the fuck? But I, <laughs> but I didn't say anything. So I was like, like, what oh, if she was no. a dude? Like, I don't yeah. really want to do that to this memory. You know what I mean? Right. Yeah. So just, I just, just leave it, it alone. It was like Angel Baby something. <laughs> so, it, <laughs> so it was like definitely a dude. It's definitely a dude. Definitely a dude. But oh, yeah, I just right. I remember being like super affected by it. You know. Damn. And yeah, like it was Dragon Ball Z roleplay, man. That was my shit. I guess. That's legit. Yeah, dude, I mean, there's worse things. I'm surprised you haven't played, like, Xenoverse much. <laughs> yeah. It's essentially Here's that. the thing. Like, in middle school, I was really into Dragon Ball Z. Uh -huh. And the older I am, the less I am. Mm. Like, I still think it's, it's like... You know how some people, like, get out of playing video games? Yeah. And they're like... Like, oh, yeah, I played video games for a long time. I remember those days. That was fun. Yeah. That's how I kind of feel about Dragon Ball Z. Oh, okay, okay. Like... Oh, I, that's something I was into, and that was cool when I was into it. But um, oh my god, there are husks here. Why? Yeah. But now it's like, no, that's not my thing. You know, Jesus, okay, okay. I need to fucking. Do you do you like associate it with when being like younger, or is it just like? I, I, it's. I mean, it just kind of lost its charm. I just lose its charm. Like I don't hate it. I think it's fine. I. I'm not. This is hard to discuss while doing this, but I. Like, I, it's grenade, just, grenade! It's just not a thing I, I'm into anymore, I guess. Mm, okay. Oh, my grenade didn't go off. What the fuck? Go off! Like, and I used to be, like, obsessed with it. And maybe that's why, maybe it's like, I was like I was so obsessed with it that I just got, I've like... This before. She it's kind of burnt out. Right, and then... Because, like, I have... The friends that I was into it with, like, you know, I'm sure they're still like, Oh, Dragon Ball Super and all that, and I'm just like, that's okay. You know? Yeah, yeah. No, I get what you mean. I, I kind of feel the same way about, like, uh, like Pokemon. Like, I fucking love Pokemon. Like, right. And I, I, I'll probably still play the new ones. Right. But, like, having had, like, a hundred hours into, like, every generation of Pokemon besides black and white is, like, a long time. <laughs> yeah, a lot oh, yeah, of time. Sure, dude. And so it's like, oh, oh my God. God. Surprise attack. But yeah, no, I get what you oh, mean. Oh, shit, they came out of both doors. Oh, God. Fucking A, man. But yeah, I have a similar type of feeling where it's like people are like, oh, my God, new Pokemon update or, like, some shit. And I'm just like, eh. Like, Here's that's the thing, cool. like, I didn't play Pokemon. Like, I played Pokemon Blue and Gold. Or blue and Red and Gold and Silver. Yeah. And then I didn't play it after that, really, till X and Y. Oh, okay. Yeah, I played it that entire time. Like, Diamond right. and Pearl was so fucking fun had like a hundred hours on both of them what does that say it was just saying that this used to be an exogeny team and now they turn into husks oh similar to what happened on eden prime oh my god but yeah so i, I get what you're saying with pokemon because i but i when i got back in x and y i was fucking in x and y right yeah you know? yeah and i i'm i'm actually very excited for um the new game i've so much so that i've been like playing like go a lot so I can get more Pokemon because you can trade with that, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. They're, that they're, it's going to be linked with Pokemon they're Go. They're integrating it pretty heavily with Pokemon Go because the idea, I think, is, hey, you like Pokemon Go? Play this fucking game. Yeah. And then you'll get more into it. But and this then, game is and then going to the make one, them more money. When well, the not, one that comes okay. out in 2019 that's more hardcore comes out. Shit, yeah. I hit missed the button. Um, then... You guys will be really into it. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's gonna bump our sales more, which I, it's not it's strictly smart. it's not strictly related to money. You know what I mean? Like, right, they, yeah. They still, I think they're still gonna make a quality game. It, it seems that way. But um, we're probably we're probably gonna let's play that game. I'm down. I got the Eevee version. 
because nice. fuck, fuck Pikachu. Damn, okay. It's like that. You just missed a decryption. Where? To the right. Oh, shit. It's like shit, that with my boy. That's what you get for talking shot on Pika. Yeah, you're right. Pika! <laughs> Pika! Game! Ding! Game! Um. So is that it? This was a wild conversation we just had that ranged from internet e -E chat role play girlfriends <laughs> to Dragon Ball Z to At Pokemon. least, like, not that I can think of. Because, like, when it comes to, like, being on the computer as a kid, my first memory is, like, playing, like, those type of games like uh, Putt Putt and, like, Pajama Sam and shit like that. Oh, yeah. That's, like, my earliest Freddy memories. Freddy Fish. Yeah, Freddy Fish. Can't forget about yeah. Freddy and Fish. And Luther. Freddy yeah. and Luther, my guys. Luther. Uh, little green boy. Dude, we should let's play some Freddy <laughs> Fish. <laughs> no, because we're going to not be able to do the puzzle, and it's going to be really fucking embarrassing. <laughs> Smasher assassination. And you Sit were like, down. oh, you should go for fitness. No, master assassination. Okay. Nah, dude. No, well, dude. We. That's you know, why. That's why we have the master assassination. Like, well, why'd you want to be a sniper? Well, I'm so not fit that I can't get close enough. Right. Exactly. So I snipe. Dude, no, we're gonna one of these days. We're gonna play like Pajama Zam or Freddy Fish. I think my favorite ones are either Putt Putt travels through time. Okay. Hmm. I don't know. For Freddy Fishes. Wasn't there like a Western one? Oh yeah, the Western one was legit. Like I Freddy that. Fish Western one, I mean. Yeah, yeah, th yeah. That's what I'm saying. But then there was also like a weird like Western dude that they had. There was, was like, like mm, a different kind of game. Yeah, right? yeah. And I didn't really play any of the Pajama Sams besides the the weather one, I think. And then it's there, like Thunder Lightning, what's not the so Fox's frightening. Name? Oh. It might just be like Agent Fox or something. Is it Agent Fox? I think. I played one of those. And then backyard backyard basketball and football. And yeah, baseball. yeah, yeah. I, I played those before, I think. Before even. Really? Yeah. Oh, this looks normal. Q Thresher Maw. Dude, if, it, if there was two Thresher Maws in one fucking world, I would be upset. Oh, my God. It's causing satellites to crash. Why? Why would you want that? Did I do anything with these satellites? Is there, can I salvage them? Salvage? Salvage? Can I salvage them? Can I succulent? <laughs> can I succulent? But yeah, it's like it goes like those type of games, and then the next thing I can Maple remember Story. is probably Maple. Did Story. you have a girlfriend on Maple Story? No, no, but I had boys that I would I would run, run with, and uh, make a bunch of different characters, have guilds, you know. That was legit. Maple Story guilds. Yeah, that, bro. That's something legit. It is legit. Is but, Maple Story two out yet? Uh, I don't know. I didn't even know that was a thing until someone joked about it, and I was like, wait, is that actually a thing? Because I was like, Maple Story, you know? My inner child was like, what? And then they were like, yeah, it's coming out. And I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, dude, Maple Story is a. I remember I re downloaded it like last year because I was like, I was feeling nostalgic. And dude, you used to like ask for nothing but Maple Story, like money. For, yeah, the Nexon points, shit. dude. Because it was oh, legit. Scavengers? It was the best. Get run over, you shit. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, before before Maple Story is a Webkins. Oh, yeah, you, you were a Webkins guy, but not Dude, a Club Penguin, right? Everyone, yeah, no, not Club Penguin. Dude, I'd play Club Penguin. But I, I remember I played it once, but I was like, this don't have shit on Webkins. Fuck y'all. And then, um, I'll kill you. Dude, I remember I used to finesse people on Webkins. I think I, think I said this on the channel before. What do you mean finesse people? On so they place? added like a trading thing, right? And you used to just like take people for all their worth? <laughs> yeah, dude, I used to finesse people so hard. So like every time you buy a Webkins, it was like $13, right? Right. Every time you buy a Webkins, Webkins was like Toy to Life before Toys to Life before like 
Before, um, like, Skylanders, Skylanders and everything and like Disney that. Disney Infinity and all that shit. Yeah. Um, but, so when you buy one, you do you type in the code to get that webkin, right? And it comes with certain, like, items that you can only get from activating a, a webkin. And it's, like, normally it comes with, like, some type of, like, vehicle that you can, like, drive around your house mm-hmm. and stuff. They wanted to make it worthwhile so you'd buy more webkins. Right, yeah, yeah. So you get in-game stuff. And then there would be, like, certain clothes or, like, furniture, normally furniture, that, like, came with that webkin. And that's the only way you can get it is from activating them. Well, this one time, my niece Mackenzie came over. And she was like, hey, I'm going to teach you this trick I've been doing. And I don't, she never told me, like, how she figured it out or what. But so you guys were you you and she taught me how to how to finesse people on webkins, right? Well, okay, my niece. I say my niece, so it sounds way younger than me, right? But she's actually a year older. We like you don't have to explain. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so that happens. It's like my cousin or niece or whatever, right? She is your niece, but she's more like a cousin. Yeah, yeah. Difference isn't there. Um, she's like a year older than you. Yeah, so. Anyway, she goes, yo. So okay, what you do? I can't you believe go, you're outing her. You go the into the right you now, go like, into the shop, and you buy like it was like carrot cake, and then like bubbles or something, and then something else, and you'd mix them together and it'd make this thing that looks like this badass like trophy or something. But it's really just a food item that you feed to your webkin, right? And I remember I used all my money just making a ton of them, right? And then you'd go into trade rooms, and you all, like, at first, it was pretty bare bones. Like, you just put up an item, and they would be, they could either do, like, a happy face or, like, a mad face, right? And if there was happy face, you knew, oh, they wanted it, right? So people, people would basically just throw stuff up. You have three slots, and you could put stuff in the different slots to trade. And I would just fucking put that trophy thing up. Uh-huh. And people would always think it was some type of like legendary or epic item or whatever, and so I finesse hell of people like so much. Like if you put it into like dollar amounts, like say like each one was like five dollars, I probably finessed like at least like three hundred dollars worth of webkin shit from people, and so did my knees. We like we had like garages basically that we made in the game from all the vehicles that we finessed from people wow you guys are wild <laughs> and then i remember like a couple months later i get back on the webkins and i was like oh like i saw i had like one left in my inventory and i was like oh shit maybe i can do it one last time and i go into the trading and then they added that when you hover over it with your mouse, it'll tell you what it is. Because it didn't oh. used to do that. You had no idea what it was except for, like, the picture of so what it was. Sc- oh, wait. Shit, there's so I couldn't scam anyone so you anymore. Sh- you couldn't scam little kids anymore. No, I couldn't. But I was a little kid, too. So it's not like... <laughs> it's, not, it's not all that. Why is there still a question mark here? Oh, I got to search this mercenary. League of One. The League of One medallion. League of Legends. But yeah, is that's a story about how I, how I, <laughs> how I finessed people on webkins. It reminds I scammed them. What it reminded me of you telling it was when I used to when I'd play X and Y, and I would. Uh, oh, you would like wonder trade I'd like wonder a weedle? trade like canopies <laughs> and shit, <laughs> and get like an Articuno. Be like, see you, bitch, dude. All right, all right. People would like say like be like mad about people who do that shit, right? And I was like, okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in a decent Pokemon. So, like, I'll put, like, a starter. Mm. And, like, I was hella into it. So, like, I had, like, their IVs I, I perfect. Bred, I bred a bunch of starters. And yeah. Shit, and then that's – I started doing but that. But they were, like, competitive ones, too. Like, their stats were, like – like, if someone got that and then used it, it would be a lot better than, less, like, some other random of that type of Pokemon. Right. So, um, I, I put, like, a good Pokemon in. And then if I got shit, I would just keep trading whatever I got until I got something that I was okay with. And sometimes it would just be, like, something from another region. 
Because I always thought that was super cool. Well, then those, like, fucking, uh... uh and then there's, like, the Masuda be- method it, or whatever. Is it the beautiflies that are different depending on where they're oh, from? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. Yeah, that Bro, was cool. I, I remember this girl from work used to play, and she had, like, a million of them. She, like, showed... She, like, showed me, like, while I was working. I was like, oh, okay. I'm, like, I'm like trying not to get in trouble. I'm, like, looking around. I was like, where... This shouldn't be happening, but like she was right. just showing me all these, these uh, it's butterfree or no 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 beautifly. Beautifly. I don't. Can we go this way? This looks way too open. Nah, oh, man, it's good. Damn. There'll probably be a fucking thresher mob again. Yeah, probably. Knowing my luck. Or fucking, uh, Surter from Thor Ragnarok's gonna <laughs> pop out. But yeah, man. Webkins was legit. Web Webkins and Pokemans. Yep. Webkins, Pokemon, and Maple girl, Story. Girlfriends and chat rooms. E. Yeah. <laughs> I think the closest thing that I had to that was in Maple Story. You could get an ex- experience boost if the people in your like. So if the people in your party were like in a guild or something. And then you could also get one, like, a higher, like, shared experience. Because you want to get, like, all of the experience from, like, something that someone else killed. But, like, you could raise how much it was. It was, like, a hidden stat, too. Like, you, no one would, like, it doesn't tell you that it does that, but it actually does. Right. right? And um, if you, like, if you married in Maple Story 2, you would get, like, a higher boost, too. So, like, people would, like, be, like, like typing in like global chat looking for people who are like their same level or like higher level that could like marry them and then boost them basically mm-hmm. so, so yeah. you were trying to get married yeah bro it, that's how you get boosted boost rank it looks like it was getting damaged i'd hope the alliance would take this meeting seriously this is darius oh instead they insult me by sending a military grunt to show me Hi, how darius. tough they are according to your file your only mark of distinction is that you stupidly got your own soldiers killed on Torfin. Bad choice of words. put up with your crap, Darius. Shall we talk, or should I just shoot you now? You can't speak to me that way. You and your alliance owe me, Shepard. What's up with his face? You see He's this got gun? some face paint. This is your gun. Your military set me up here, and now it wants to pretend it doesn't know me. But I know the Damn. truth. The Alliance needed me here, so treat me with the respect I deserve! What do you, you mean? You said we set you up. Did the Alliance give you weapons? After the Batarians were driven out of the Verge, the Alliance wanted to stabilize the region. I had the strongest syndicate in the area. They gave me the weapons and money I needed oh, to take like over. They gave money and oh my weapons God. to Al-Qaeda. Do not pretend we are so different, soldier. I deserve your Alliance's gratitude, not these attacks! Someone once said that diplomacy comes from the barrel of a gun. You can't talk to Darius, oh shit, they are everywhere. I did not realize go, that. Go, Fucking A. Go, go, go! Go, 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 go! Go, go, go! How great kid! I'm going up top. I don't like this vantage point. Oh, hi, big boy! Nice to see ya. What's nice. up, big beautiful? No, he's doing that shit where he cheats. Yeah, they always fucking cheat. Fuck Bro, he must throw an ass bro. See you later, Lord Darius. Is that him? Yeah. 19k. They put some respect on his name, though. Lord Darius? Like, okay. Well, he's a warlord, Darius. Well, I mean, like, Warlord Darius has a little bit of, like, negative connotation. Or it's just Lord Darius. It's just, like, badass. You cheating bastard. Fuck. Stop it. God, man. Fucking Krogans are ass. (laughs) I hate Krogans. (laughs) Hello. He's like, where is he? Where is he? What were you doing? Why were you just staring at the wall? He was ta- he was saying goodbye to his chat room girlfriend, dude. No, dude. You just split them apart. Never can say goodbye, girl. 
I can't say goodbye. No, 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 no. Either no, die no, no. a hero or live long enough to see yourself become the villain. How do I get in here? There's somebody in here and I can't Maybe get the in. power things. Maybe they're down here. Maybe I'm wrong. Dude, you're like Paul Blart. You need like a... I need a Segway. <laughs> yeah. Or you, you need like a, a lollipop or you're going to pass out. It's getting darker. Sun's going real low. Sun, sun's getting low. Any day that ends with one last crackpot self-proclaimed proclaim lord out of the frontier is a good one. You've earned yourself for... Yeah. He's earning millions. I don't know what this... Fuck. Oh, sh sh Shepard. Shepard. All right, everybody. We're going to end this episode here, and I hope you enjoyed yourself with this nice long chat about... Me, girls. Memories for us. Oh, wait. Actually, you know what? Let's see if we can open this door. By blowing these up. I doubt I even have to do this. I, I bet the door Shepard. just is open now. That you broke one of them? No, that the battle's over. Oh. Yeah, maybe. But what we'll else see. would it do? What? What else would the power generate? Well, I think you do? just blow us up and the explosion hurt damages enemies. Oh, no. I well, feel like it did it. Well, no. we'll never know. Secure weapon locker. Blah. Override succeeded. Weapon locker, not so secure. Seemed more secure than the other one, honestly. Aid station. AIDS. Terminal, <laughs> aid station. Exit door opened. Oh, I needed to do that, apparently. Hardened storage locker. All right, we got a bunch of stuff. All right, anyway, bye, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Belong to you, my friend. And now it's time to go. All right, the Pete. moon, the bear, and the big blue house <laughs> will be waiting for you to come and play. To come and play. To Dude, I'm so sad. Play. I just liked when the bear. R.I.P. to all the chat girl, the the all the chat room girlfriends out there. I just liked in that song when the bear would say, when it's like time to go, and he'd be like, time to go, and his like fucking yeah. big ass head would like, <laughs> like fucking, because he had the longest neck of any yeah, bear dude. ever. Anyway, we ended the episode, so I don't know why we're still talking uh, about that. We don't even like each other. We don't talk to each other outside of recording Let's Plays.